So now I'm just putting on the chain and master link and then I'll just get all this in and then we can push the engine backwards, tighten everything up. All right, so now that we have the clear valve cover, we're kind of just gonna beef up our valve train a little bit with these Go Power Sports, um, basically like a cast rocker arm setup. A lot easier to do it on these, it's kind of more of a hemi style to where you just like loosen and tighten in this. Right now they're really tight, but I'll get them adjusted and it'll look really cool with our clear valve cover. So Go Power Sports sells this, link in the description. Totally check it out. Okay, so there they are in there. Sitting pretty. So now let's just see if it runs. Okay, so we have the kill switch mounted. We got it all wire wrapped, zip tied down, going all the way down under. And let's see if it works. There we go. Hey, let's go drive this thing. Hi. So we're here. Now we're gonna let her rip, tear chip. Rally cart is here in all our glory. Uh, we filmed a lot at the concrete spot, but we weren't really a fan of how the footage was turning out. So we came here, dirt where it really belongs, but it's been a while. We haven't, we've actually haven't driven the cart on concrete for a really long time. And this is actually like up to date videos. So it's not, nothing from the summer. So pretty cool. We're also working on like a rally cart Gimkana project, which would be pretty cool. We're about to film that right after this. So look forward to that for sure. That'll probably be like a Wednesday upload. So with that being said, we're gonna hop on this thing and show sure what it's really made of.
Like built, like built predators. Well done, built predators. Sounds so good. I guess it's not really built. It's just got like, I mean, really, just stage one predator sounds so good. playground out here. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Um, this pretty much concludes the build part of the rally cart build. So all future videos of this thing will hopefully just be ripping around, having a ton of fun. Um, it held up really good. It takes a little while to get into the rev range all in concrete just because it has a bunch of grip, but it's kind of better because when you're drifting on like on um, like gravel or something, it can get up in that upper rev range to get more RPM to the tires. So that's really cool. But Everything on this thing is from Go Power Sports. Links are in the description, so be sure to check them out for all of this stuff. I mean, it's high quality product. The clear valve cover is awesome, as well as with those rocker arms we put on. Really made valve lash adjustment really easy. So thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe. See you next time.